Having tried and failed, my father was unable to make a gardener out of me. I had no qualms, of course, about enjoying the fruits of his labor, the uh, potatoes, the squash, and the cucumbers. All right, so the correct answer here is A, no change. And let's talk about why this is the correct answer. So first, you'll probably want to know what the word qualms mean. So a, a qualm here is a, a hesitation. So this means you don't want to do something if you have a qualm about it. So if you have no qualms, you have no hesitations, it means you want to do something. And in this case, the author wanted to eat the potatoes, squash, and cucumber. He liked eating the vegetables, but he did not want to garden. So he didn't want to grow vegetables, but he wanted to eat them. He wanted his dad to do the growing for him. And when the author says, of course, the reason that this is a pretty reasonable thing to say is because, of course, a young kid is going to be greedy. It's kind of a, a little bit of a joke, but of course he was a selfish young kid. All right, so that is a, a reasonable, correct thing to say. Now let's talk about why the other possibilities are incorrect. So in B, it says, more important, I had no qualms. Now what this implies is that the, st that the fact that the author enjoys potatoes, squash, and cucumber is more important that, to this essay than the fact that he doesn't want to be a gardener. And uh, that's certainly not true. In fact, the most important part of this essay is the fact that the author doesn't want to be a gardener because he learns over time to like that. Whereas uh, it doesn't really, he doesn't change his attitude about enjoying fruits and vegetables. So the next, uh, the next possible phrase, it says, it stands to reason then that I certainly would have no qualms about enjoying the results of his labor. So what that means is that we can go from the fact, the idea that uh, the author was not enjoying gardening, we could reason from that that he must enjoy eating potatoes, squash, and cucumber. But you could not make that. It's perfectly possible that someone wouldn't like gardening and they wouldn't like making, uh, eating potatoes, squash, and cucumbers. And finally, I had no qualms as a consequence of it. And this, once again, consequence of it would imply that the, uh, as a consequence of not liking to garden, he must enjoy eating potatoes. And once again, that doesn't flow logically. You couldn't infer that he must like eating potatoes from the fact that he doesn't like to garden. Therefore, the correct answer is A, no change.